Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to the Saving Made Simple channel. My name is Bella and today I'm here with my brand new holiday launch. So this will be my first time doing Christmas launch and it's probably, I think, the biggest launch I've done yet. So I'm really, really excited. Um, I think all of these items will be available as of November 4th. Um, so keep that in mind. But I'm going to show you guys first my minis. So they come as usual in a print off of three. So we've got these ones here. So this one here, um, there's three little spots. So you can choose the value of each light bulb. This one here, you choose the value of each present. And this one here, you choose the value of each uh, gingerbread man. Moving on to the next, we have these ones here. It's the idea of you know, Santa's always watching. So again, we've got the reindeer one, which uh, you get to choose the value of each colored Christmas ball. Then we have the nutcracker one, and it's, um, you can just cross off the boxes as you go. This one's worth 20. And then this one here, again, you get to choose the value of your mistletoe. So those ones, those are the um, orders that they go in. So these three are on one and these three are on one they will be available as a um pdf file and then of course uh they also come as freebies with every order or you can get the um mini savings challenge packs and these could be included with those as well um so yeah those are those all right let's move on to some board games so first and foremost we have the search for Santa's sleigh. So what you're going to do is you're going to start here. You're going to roll a dice and each spot is worth something different. So a red spot is worth $2. A green spot is worth $1. The deer is worth $5. The white gift is worth $3. Santa hat is $10. Red gift is $6. Um, and I think that's it. But basically, oh no, Santa Slay and Reindeer have gotten away from him. Thankfully, they've left a trail for you to follow. Roll a dice and travel along the board to help reunite him with his items so he can still get toys to all the girls and boys this Christmas. So there's that one. Next, we have this one here, and I've called it Elf Race. So welcome to the first official Elf Race, where every elf is competing to finish his or her gift for Santa first. So you're going to roll or to play, roll a dice, save whatever you roll and cross that color or, or color off one dice of that value. The first elf to reach their gift wins. Good luck to all. So again, you're going to roll your dice. If you roll a one, you're going to color off a one. And every time you roll whatever number, you're going to um, get a little closer to your gift. And the first elf whose line is finished will win. But this one could go on for a while, so I did make a dashboard. Unfortunately, I'm still kind of messing around the sizing of that one. Uh, so I, I, I think for now, um, if you order this one physically, I will include an, um, a dashboard, but I'll probably message you and ask you if you prefer a uh, three by six or a uh, whatever A5 is. So there's that. All right, and then next we've got this one here. So it's called Spice Your Speed. It's basically a odd or even slash heads or tails. So you can choose whether you want to play with a dice or if you'd rather play with a coin. Um, if you want to choose a coin, then you can do heads because there's a face on this one and tails for the candy. Or you can do odd and even, whatever you'd like to do. But essentially you're going to pick what each um, side is worth. And then whenever you... If you roll a dice and you get an odd, then you're going to be saving this much. Or if you get an even, you're going to be saving this much. So um, there's that. All right, now we're going to go on to the scratch and saves. So I have a few new ones made up. So there's this one here first. So we've got naughty or nice. There is a 60 and a 75. I do not have any bigger uh, ones available right now. I'll just kind of see if you guys are interested in anything higher. So again, we got a 60 and a 75. And what you're going to do is you are going to scratch each, each space to uncover either a naughty elf or a nice elf. If you uncover a naughty elf, you're gonna save $10. If you uncover a nice elf, you're gonna save $5. Um, so yeah, there's those. Okay, 
Next, we've got this one here. So far, I've only got the 50 made up. Um, so what you're going to do is you're just going to scratch a present. Under each present is a dollar value. And whatever you uncover is what you're going to save. This one here, again, is worth $50. And then we've got have a uh, have a holly jolly jelly belly Christmas. So these ones here come in 50s or 75s. I'm still planning on how big I want them to be. So I've got the bigger one that has a bit of a white border and then I have one with no border. I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do. So this one is very similar to um, my loose change challenge. So basically you're just going to scratch one of the jelly bellies and um, you're going to save whatever you uncover. So again, there's the $50 one, which values are between $1 and $6. And then there's the 75, which values are between three and $7. All right, and the ones you guys have all been waiting for. So I've got the holiday um, for the hit and miss. I've got holiday classics. I've got giggle fest or I've got twin teens. So the holiday classics are of course, anything holiday related. Then we've got Giggle Fest, which uh, these movies are kind of more personal. I've actually picked them based on what I find funny, um, but I think you guys will like it. And the twin teens is any classic movies that were released between 2011 and 2019. So there's a good little chunk of space in there. Um, this one here will not be sold. Um, <clears throat> I'm probably going to, I've got, I don't know. It, it turned out kind of, it, it got a crinkle in it. I tried something new. I used a different kind of paper and for some reason it got like a crinkle in it. I don't really know how it happened, <clears throat> but um, I don't know. I might have to actually start one of those I did say like I would um open up a thing on my Etsy store where if you are okay with some slightly less than perfect items then you can just add that onto your order like it'd probably be like a dollar or it would probably be like a scratch and saves would probably be two dollars and then just anything else would probably be a dollar um and it would just be thrown into your physical order but I figured if anyone didn't want this one, I would just give it away to my sister. But uh, for um, presentation's sake, it does the trick. So again, these ones here will be available in uh, sets of three for $20 or they're $7.50 each. Um, everything that I've shown you today is possible to show up in the, um, in the gamers packs that I do have up on my channel. So I do have mini gamers packs, games and challenges packs, and then I have scratch and save packs. Um, and then I've got the all inclusive packs. So those, everything that you've seen today is uh, eligible or possible to appear in one of those packs. Um, so yeah, that's, uh, those are all my new items so far. Um, as I continue to create, I will show you guys as things come out. Um, but yeah, so that's what I've got so far. So keep an eye on my um, Etsy store, which is under Saving Made Simple. The link will be in the description below. And uh, these, again, will be up and available as of Monday, November 4th. And um, yeah, that's, that's all I've got for you guys today. So thank you so, so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Very short, very sweet. And um, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and let me know in the comments which challenge you are most excited for. Uh, the Holly, Holly Jolly Jelly Belly Christmas, the um, Christmas Tree of Presents, Naughty or Nice, um, Spicy or Sweet, Elf Race. I'm really excited to play Elf Race, I'm not going to lie. Um, the Search for Santa's Sleigh, or of course, the new Scratch and Save uh, Hit or Miss uh, challenges. So let me know in the comments below, and I will see you guys with my next video, which should be coming out on... Wednesday because it'll be my um budget breakdown so thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys then take care